There are a number of actions you can take on the Live Hire profile. If you're looking for information on messaging a candidate, you can watch our messaging a candidate video, which can be found on our Help Center. One of the first things you can do on the Live Hire profile is move the candidate from different stages in the talent pipeline. You can move them from the talent community stage to talent pooled to hired. Next, you can add a rating to the candidate. This will apply to their profile throughout your entire talent community. You can download their CV in Word or PDF format, change their relationship status, whether they're internal, external, contractor, or alumni, and add if they were referred by someone. In the next section, you can add notes on the Live Hire profile. These are internal facing only. You can also add tags, which can be filtered when you're searching for candidates in your talent community. Milestones, such as phone interviews. Documents, which are once again only visible to the recruiters in your talent community and not the candidates. And highlights. The highlights show up on the business card view of the Live Hire profile. This is where you can add in some key information about that candidate. If you navigate to the activity log of the Live Hire profile, then you can see that you can filter by the different sections, such as notes, milestones, or documents. If you want information on talent pooling or jobs, you can check out our Help Center for more videos. Thanks for watching.